am Rafa Benita. Uh, you are watching the Red Men TV. Hello and welcome to the Red Men TV. I'm Chris Paydak and this is the first starting eleven prediction show of the season. I am fully hyped. Liverpool taking on Stoke at 4 p.m. on Sunday at the Britannia Stadium. We have taken the production vibes of this show through the roof. We have got the shit to boot your board. We've got these players stickers that we made during the summer. It took us about eight hours. We're gonna get our money's worth out of this. We've got magnets on the back. The magnets are gonna work, but I'm gonna get straight into I'm going to give you what I think Brendan Rodgers will select as Liverpool's opening day team against Stoke um, got it in my hand may as well go first in Simon Mignolet and goal. I don't think there's any question marks about Simon Mignolet if you do leave me your name and your thoughts on why Bogdan should be the keeper in the comment section below and I'll ignore you because you're on crack okay right right back it's magic to come off magic it's going to be Nathaniel Klein. Nathaniel Klein. Can you see that? He's in it right back. I mean, I told you the production values were going through the roof. Looks like Nathaniel Klein is going somewhere else. Um, centre back, his partner, the man who eats nails for breakfast, Captain Madface, Martin Skittle himself. No question marks. The next position, though, is a little bit different. I'll have a consonant, please, Carol. Uh, I'm going for Lovren. I think Lovren's going to play. I think the question mark is obviously whether Mamadou Sacco partners Skittle in the middle of the fence. I think what I've seen from pre-season so far suggests that Lovren is going to be the man that plays this game against Stoke. And I think it's his job until he fucks up enough so that Sacco can come in and actually show him how to defend properly. But for now, Mamadou, I'm really sorry, mate. You'll probably be storming out of the dressing room out the stadium because once again I think Lovren's going to be picked ahead of you um, more question marks I mean the lads on the show the general consensus is that Joe Gomez is going to start at left back but it's not the lads on the show's show is it it's my show so Gomez can get gone we'll put him down there because we want to have a little conversation about him but I do think that Alberto Moreno is going to be playing look he was come back into pre-season he was a little touch injured he was given a little bit of an extended break because of that Joe Gomez has been outstanding I'm not saying he hasn't been uh, I actually liked I'd like to see more of Joe Gomez but I don't think pinning our hopes on an 18 year old centre defender at left back is good strategy you know I don't want us to ruin him I think he's one for the future I think he's probably going to be playing in this position hopefully as the Andre Wisdom will come back and he could actually form a partnership if Wisdom develops himself of course so I'm going to take Joe Gomez out of there reluctantly and I'm sure the lads Paul, Aubrey and John will be gutted but you know if that's if they watch this show uh, going on to the midfield of course next I think there's no question marks over captain Jordan Henderson Court Klein see that for a catch that's real actions that isn't it i don't know what we're gonna do here i'm just gonna fill a little bit of time maybe oh look at that he's gone for the magnet underneath there you go and where was i jordan henderson the captain in the center of midfield tom's pissing himself behind the cameras i frantically mess around with magnets live recorded for youtube anyway james milner is gonna be partnering Jordan Henderson, and you can see the formation that I've gone for sort of starting to rear its ugly head, if you will. I'm going 4 2 3 1. Now, honourable mentions, of course, from Ray Chan and Lucas Lever, because look, it's Stoke. We got battered there last season. It was 6 1, unfortunately, to Stoke. I haven't seen the game. I was away. I was in Berlin on a stag do. If I'd have seen the game, I couldn't remember it. Anyway, it was that mad of a stag, dude. But anyway, here we go. Lucas, defensive midfielder. Is he going to play against Stoke? I don't think so. I think we've seen on midfield. And Emery Chan had a powering performance from midfield um, against Swindon, of course. But I think he played a little bit further up the pitch there. It was a little bit more box-to-box, -box, so I don't think he's in line for this game. Uh, moving on to the attacking midfielders. No, it's not going to be Firmino, I'm afraid. He's not playing this game. It's just too soon for him, unfortunately. It's going to be that man, the one who's going to take over Raheem Sterling's position at this club, Jordan I, because he's had an absolutely incredible pre-season. He scored a fucking world-class goal as well. He's going to be in the side. I think the only person that can go in the middle of Jordan I and behind who's going to be the striker, of course, is the sex bot himself, Philip, the key master, Coutinho, and that's not Coutinho, Robbie, that's Coutinho. And then we've got Firmino. No, no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It's not going to be Firmino, it's really not. It's going to be Adam Lallana. And because Adam Lallana's had a decent pre-season, he's been playing on the left-hand side, Phil Coutinho's going to drop in there, Adam Lallana. And up front, as Paul would like to say, Big Ben, 
I'm not going to say Big Ben because his name's Ben Teke and Big Ben is Ben Roethlisberger from the pits there. So he was the quarterback there. Two Super Bowl rings, you know what I mean? That's Big Ben. This guy is a fucking beast, but his name's Ben Teke. So there you have it. There's my team. Four, two, three, one. I want Coutinho up near, buzzing around Ben Teke, looking for any little thing. I want Adam Lallana doing the patented Adam Lallana turn, bamboozling defenders and scoring from the top right. Can we just have that one more time, Tom? Adam Lallana bamboozling defenders with the uh, Lallana turn. It's going to be epic. It's going to be incredible. And Jordan Ives going to get down the wing, cross the ball, Ben Teke goal, Liverpool win, 1-0 with that side. Thank you very much. That's the Start 11 Prediction Show. Don't forget to check out the Uncentered Math Build-Up Show. Don't forget, straight after the game, we'll be back with match reactions from outside the Britannia. I'm buzzing for it. You're buzzing for it. Leave your comments below. Give the video a thumbs up. Take eight. We desperately need a forward. And he's, he's our forward and he'll be on the pitch. Well, against the physical side, like Stoke, we need a physical striker, don't we? Yeah. yeah so we'll go with the region. I, I, I hope, I just got, I really hope Ben Tacky does, you know, fulfills that. Because how many times do we say that? We're trying to figure out what teams you, you should play Carroll against. You know what I mean? It's like, well, you, we, do you play him against teams that are big physical teams because ultimately they're used to dealing with that more? Or you are a big physical